Energy for All are the UK's leading experts in cooperative-owned renewable energy schemes. They have helped establish seven cooperatives across the UK. More than 7,000 members have invested over £16 million in the equivalent of over 20 megawatts of wind energy capacity. Energy for All is a company run on a not-for-profit basis. Its philosophy is to provide lifetime support for cooperative ownership of renewable electricity. The way we work with community groups is typically that a group will approach us, so they provide the core of what's going to occur. We provide them with the technical expertise, the financial expertise, the business expertise and the experience of having done it, which is a key thing. Energy for All have got the experience, they've got the history, they've got the track record, they understand the kind of requirements, what's going to make a project viable and what isn't. So they can prevent people from wasting a lot of time on a project that isn't going to work and they can really put their shoulder behind a project that's got potential and, and make it happen. Our largest project to date is West Mill, which is a six and a half megawatt project, which is very thriving down in West Oxfordshire and has developed its own community outreach programme through WESET, their own charity. The wind farm being here, I think, has had an impact on the local community in a whole range of ways. And the fact that it's a community owned wind farm makes a big difference. The first thing is that they've just experienced what the reality of a wind farm is. And they've realised that all the things they heard about impact on their environment really hasn't happened. No changes to property prices, no loud noises like a pop group, all the things that they thought might be the case. And they can see that some of their money is going towards further education and outreach work, which they're very, very positive about and committed to. So they feel they're making a difference and they feel that this is a beacon of hope, really. People certainly, once they see a co-op in action, they get quite enthused about it. It was wonderful on the first open day that we had here when we were launched and the wind farm was actually up and running to see people having their photograph taken in front of a wind turbine, pointing up and saying, the tip of that wind turbine is mine. The advantages of the model itself are that it's democratic. The idea that I've only put £250 into this, but I've got one vote, and that guy who put 20,000 quid in, he's only got one vote too. So people really engage with that. I think that the benefits to the community are partly that you see where your energy is coming from, it becomes real, and that's very important, if, particularly as we look towards changing our energy consumption and addressing climate change. It enables people to know that the money that they're making goes back into the community, it's not going out into, into shareholders miles away. It's completely unreasonable to expect people just to put money in and expect not to see it again and with no return for 20 to 25 years. Our model is designed to give a reasonable rate of return. Anybody who puts about a couple of thousand pounds into one of our projects can reasonably claim that they own the generating capacity to supply the electricity for the average UK household. Now for £2,000 you won't get solar PV on your house. Energy for All's combination of business skills with a social enterprise ethos has made possible many projects which wouldn't have happened otherwise and it's a model that can be replicated. One of the major problems faced by community groups is raising the risk capital to do all the pre-planning work. This can easily run to six figures and if you don't get planning permission that money is lost. So we established another unique business which is the Energy Prospects Co-op, which raised a million pounds of risk capital, which it's now investing back into the development of new co-ops. ng has existed for 10 years. Throughout that time, we have been extremely keen to extend into other technologies. We're hoping shortly to do a deal to take into community ownership a five megawatt PV installation, and we at various points have looked at small-scale hydro, which we are hoping with the introduction of the feed-in tariff may become possible. Energy for All have stayed with us from once the turbines are built. They monitor the production, they give us financial reports, they help us run our annual general meetings, they act as a front face for the co-op, dealing with queries from residents and from co-op members. 
It was their advice and support and solid hard work right from the beginning and through the many, many years that it took us to get through planning that led to us finally being able to say, here we have a community-owned wind farm, thanks to Energy Fuel.